Well, good afternoon. How's everyone doing? Well, at least when this is uploaded, it'll be like more like good evening, late night. I generally upload around like 8 p.m. every day, I believe. Uh, like 8 p.m. Central. Uh, well, welcome back to Legend of Dragoon. I'm kind of groggy. I just woke up, getting my booty ready for work. Um, last episode, we started Typeroa. We were in Fletz. Princess was a massive bee, a biatch. And we made our way through like a wasteland or whatever. Bandit stole Dragoon, or uh, Darts Dragoon Spirit. And now we're going into Dono. Dono Origato, Mr. Roboto. The Flower City. Oh, that's pretty. Well, welcome to Dono, the Flower City. Thank you. Thank God. You don't look like bandits. Your clothes are so filthy that at first I thought you might be. We really are covered in dust. It's natural the girl would be mistaken. Don't stare at me like that. It's not that bad. We don't have time for fooling around. Are you jealous? Oh yeah, she's a little jealous. I'm just concerned about the Dragoon spirit. No! What are you going to do? Uh-oh. We are deciding now. Hehehe. <laughs> As I expected, you are one of the sacred sisters of Mil Sesu, aren't ya? You have such a pretty face. Um I guess it's probably like Ses Seseu Seseu, but I'm gonna say Sesu. Uh just for easy <laughs> don't you give such pretty faces I mean I don't know if you can tell from here I don't know she looks kind of pretty with her five polygon one polygon face great selling her will make us rich don't make a noise and we won't harm you some somebody help oh Gentlemen over there, please. Just go away or you'll be sorry. Are you gonna get in our way? Please continue. What? If you don't mind dying. You are the one to die! Ugh. What? What did you do? Shall I continue? Holy shit! He's burning! Get out of here! <laughs> Please wait! I don't know who you are, but thank you very much for helping me. It's nothing. Oh, please, let me at least have your name. It's Lloyd. My, my name is Wink. I'm a sacred sister of Milsesu. Oh, Lloyd. Did you say her name was Wank? I think those bandits were about to get a wank. This city belongs to us. If you want to survive in this city, don't mess with us. Yeah, they running shit. 
half a year ago it was a joyful agreeable and happy city but since the bandits came all the flowers are not doing well I mean they kind of seem like they're doing pretty well see there's even a piece of stardust over here because they're so stupid oh in the water see? they're so stupid they didn't even know uh, the next one is, uh, well, I'll mention it when we get there. But Foist, we need to go in here and, you know, gets patched up and all that good stuff. I won't hit that save point right away. I'm not desperate for it yet. It hasn't been long enough. I, I'm a bit of a uh, chronic saver. I will save almost any time a game gives me a chance. Oh, why did you go, Lynn? We are having a wedding soon. It's impossible to have a talk with the Garriches. Garricks. The Garricks. I'm going to say Garricks. Garricks sounds cooler. Who, who are you? Don't worry. We are not bandits. Really? There is something wrong, isn't there? We might be able to be of some help. Tell us. Okay. It all started this morning. When I finished my errands and came home, Lynn was gone. In his letter, it says he is going to persuade the gang to pull themselves out of Dona. I'm supposed to wait for him at home. He left a letter? I have an idea. If I show this letter to the mayor, he might do something to help. The mayor is Lynn's father. I see. Let's bring this to the mayor. You have to wait for Lynn here. Oh, thank you. Wired letter from Lynn. Good stuff. Lynn is the son of the mayor, so if you show that letter to the mayor, he might be able to do something for us. Well, I hope so. These are not eaten by bugs at all. It must be well taken care of. Mmm, bugs. Sweet, sweet bugage. Boogage. Bugage. I am looking for the person who saved the life of Sister Wank. I mean, Wank. <laughs> you are warriors, aren't you? Have you heard the name Sister Wank? Sister Winkin? It's a nice day today. The best day for laundry. Good for you. Got some items. T that's it? Fine, we'll let you, but only today. Let's go. Ah, these, these are dicks, too. Everybody around here is just a bunch of assholes. I mean, except for the, like, the people themselves, you know, right? Clearly this garage gang, a bunch of, bunch of pricks. A silver vest. Well, give it to her, even though I'm never going to use her. I mean, I'll, I'll probably end up using her. I mean, that's the only reason I do keep everybody well equipped and, you know, ready to whip, you know? I don't want to see Pa and Ma flattering gangs anymore. Uh, I, mean, I can't really say I blame him. Poor kid. Got Angel's Bear, Batty Pier. I need one of those. Brave Twister! I'm not really. I'm not, I, don't, I don't really want that. Items are going to become a constant problem. I'm almost actually ready to switch down to like one angel prayer. Like one angel prayer. 
Oh, I still need another body as well. I, I gotta get rid of some magic. Goodbye. <laughs> get rid of a Thunderbolt too, because it's like a multi. Oh, I do have two. I just haven't organized it apparently or some shit. Oh, I really don't want to drop down to that, but... Well, we'll call it good there. We'll rough it. Oh, it's just one of those. I don't need your services, good sir. At least I don't think I do. No. Oh, so close. Well, that's unfortunate. It has been one month since we reported the damage by bandits. Nothing happened, and nobody came either. Except for me. <laughs> All right. Gangs on the land, sea dragons in the sea. The city is doomed. I don't know why, but gangs come here a lot. They don't have any faith. Endure the hardship, overcome the sorrow, and wait for the day when flowers bloom in our hearts again. Oh, beautiful. Pichu, Pichu. Did this, did, wait. Did Pokemon steal the idea of Pichu from, from Legend of Dragoon? I mean, he just said it, he said Pichu. And I'm pretty sure this came out before Pichu was a thing. Bow, wow, bow, wow. I would like to go over there, but there's a scary person there. Like, uh, I don't know why, but that old bag is wandering around over there. Oh, this town's a little bigger than I remembered it. They have been here for days. Uh, what should I do? Although they say bars and bums are inseparable, I wish it were only true in bugs. Oh. It's too scary to tell them to get out. Uh, what should I do? Brother Garrett is too soft. He even tried to calm a crying brat. <laughs> what is Brother Garrett thinking about? <laughs> they, I think he's, I think they're supposed to be like drunk or something. <laughs> All right. All right. Oh, oh, you're on my last nerve, lady. This is the way to the mayor's house. I won't let any suspicious people pass through here. Well, I'm not suspicious. Right? You know, this total stranger in the town. Alright, where's that? Where's the goods? I know you got the goods. It is tidy. It shows a person's personality. Yeah, I'm not very tidy. You cannot meet the mayor because he is busy. I'm sorry, but please come back some other time. Can you take a look at this letter? Th this is... Yeah, you done changed your mind, didn't you? <laughs> please come in. Mayor, a horrible thing has happened. It's about Mr. Lin. What kind of man would venture to face the Garrich gang by himself? I don't know. Mm. Mr. Lin that... Wait, Mr. Lin was that consumed with? It was my fault for not realizing it. I bet Miss K is very stressed. You must go. As the mayor, I don't want you to be involved in this. We are already involved. <laughs> yeah. The gang took something very important away from me. 
Where do they come from? They are from the Valley of Corrupted Gravity, but we don't know anything about them other than that. That place is very dangerous. They say nobody can come back once they enter the valley. Butler, don't say that. Lynn, Lynn went there. His name is literally Butler. Man, I feel bad. I mean, sorry for any of you people out there named Butler, but what the fuck? Who does that? Now, we have to gather the people of Dono and form a rescue team. And then what will happen to the city? The gang might take over the city. Let us do it. You were planning to go anyway, weren't you? Oh, it is encouraging to hear that warriors like you are going. Now I can face those punks in our city with courage. Yeah. The mayor is right. We'll fight against the gangs. I don't know how much people will trust my word, but I will do the best I can. Cool, man. Can I, uh, I just need to loot your house. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I got the stardust. Let's get the, let's get out of here. Time to leg it. Leg it like Legolas. Legging it like Legolas. Leg it like Legolas. Legolas. Hey you, Alki, how dare you touch my butt? You that you touched my butt. Don't be silly, why would I dare to touch the butt of a kid like you? What did you say? I can forgive you if you'd admit that I am too sexy to ignore and apologize. Huh? Is this kid dreaming or what? I can't stand it anymore! Fuck, was that a sword? Ouch, you... You don't know who we are! I know! You think you can get away with it? Let me see! Why does she look abnormally buff? She looks buff as shit! I think so. I actually, you know, I thought this person was a dude when I first played. It's kind of funny. Like that model is not flattering. Darn, you'll pay for this. I won't be paying you. I just see have a better way to say goodbye. Are you one of the garage gang? Do you want me to smash you too? Platinum hair? The same as Lloyd. The rest is different. <laughs> I mean, obviously, right? Are you maybe one of my groupies? Hmm. Don't seem like it, though. You guys are some strange group of people. What's your name? It's Dart. Mine's Miru. I'm the best dancer in Dono. We don't have time for playing with a kid. I agree, we can't waste any time if we are going to help Lynn. Sorry, but we gotta get going. You said Lynn? You guys are going to rescue Lynn. How did you find out about that? Cause I heard it from Kate. But people in this city are all chickens, right? So I was gonna make a raid on their hideout. Their hide. I was about to say hide out. <laughs> the the hide out. The, then those bastards gave me a hard time. They're stinky. I guess they didn't take me seriously because I'm alone. You know what? I'm gonna go with you guys. Hey, you don't need to make such a face. Just leave her alone, let's go. Hold on, do you guys know where the hideout is? It's somewhere in the Valley of Corrupted Gravity, isn't it? <coughs> wow, how naive. You make it sound so easy, but you cannot go through such a mel of a... of a hess. 
a hell of a mess kind of place without a person like me who's totally knowledgeable and totally pretty. Besides, you need the permission of the king just to enter the valley, don't you know that? What are we going to do, Dart? This girl's serious. Oh, well, you can come. Yeah, more the merrier. Are you serious? We can trust your intentions to rescue Lynn. Besides, we don't know the place. We might need a guide. Oh yeah, she's, she's tripping out how happy she is. Look at that. Right? He's completely right. Now, let's go, beautiful dancer Miru. And friends, form a posse for dealing with the Garage Gang. Awesome. I, I, I absolutely do adore Miru in this game. She is bush, isn't it? And, uh, <laughs> sorry, Hatchel. <laughs> sorry, bud. Dang, she must have been beating on a whole bunch of these dudes. Sorry, level 17. That's scary. Oh, yeah, this is like a little port out here. I love the sea. Don't you think so, huh? We cannot put the ship out to sea since the huge sea dragon appeared. We had to put the ship on land. What's the child got to say? It's not only a sea dragon that has appeared in Elisa Bay. Well, it's a great view. Got, got to admit. Yeah, this is like a really nice scene that put here. Definitely got a lot of charm. Do, 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 do. Move out the fuck of the way. Oh my god. Go my way. <laughs> oh, I gotta run back to the, the weapon shop. Just in case Miru needs like an upgrade, or whatever. man it's gonna be one of those days nope looks like she's already all equipped and ready to whip Well, it looks like we do need to save and uh, we're going to run back to Flats real quick and see if we can get permission from the king. Probably should do a little bit of training too. I mean, it wouldn't hurt, but nah, we'll do that later. Almost. Ah, see, look at her. She's mad adorable. That character model is a lot more flattering. <laughs> it's like, it sounds. <laughs> she wields a hammer. That's just badass. Come on. I'm just saying, I know how to party. This is a party right here. She even falls over on herself. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, that's that is 
one of the most amazing fanfares in video games. She's a badass, but also a bit of a klutz. They really made it fit her personality. Giving her a tangin. Poison? Oh, what a dick move. Oh my god, everybody is missing that asshole. Is he gonna have to be up to me? Am I gonna have to put this to bed? You better not. Oh, you motherfucker. Man, that's some bad luck. You usually only get like one person poisoned in these situations. Or if I could be a cheap ass and just make it all the way to town. Well, I gotta use at least one body purifier, because I think we got an extra one. I'll use it on dart. Rose will heal through it. Sorry, Rose, you're gonna have to just rough it with that poison in your body. Slowly killing you. Everything poisons you here. No wonder why I don't train here. This place is annoying as shit. Yes. Burning rush. She's a little weak at first. I just gotta train up her additions a bit. And get her a proper weapon. Yes. Burning rush. I think she does have one of the hardest additions in the game. I know it's like one that I have a hard time pulling off. But she's so quick. So quick on her feet. Like she just had two turns in a row. That's impressive. Can I switch to Crush Dance yet? Come on, Crush Dance. Yeah. Okay, get me out of this place. Get me out of this forsaken land. Hopefully non-suspicious cut just happened. Because I had another problem today. I really need to get that fixed, honestly. My, I've been having USB bus issues since like the days of USB buses being invented. I'm almost positively sure of it. Um, hopefully my new setup, I got like a little monitor review for it. Hopefully it fixed it. But, oh my God. God hates me. All right, anyhow. We need the permission of the Tiberoan King to enter the Valley of Corrupt Gravity. Have you met him? 
I think I met him several times when I was little. If the king remembers you, it'll be quick. That's our king. Dignity, huh? I'm not going to reveal my identity. I am not traveling as the king of Sertio. I am traveling as your companion and Lavitz's friend. Oh. Oh. Guess we better go check out the uh, weapon shop here. The, uh, the, uh, the weapon shop. What do you got in the uh, weapon shop? Anything good, anything good, anything good? It's all shit and trash and trash shit. Thanks. I think we're good. Let's head all right on up there. Give, him, give this guy a belly a little jiggle. A little commence the jiggling. Hey, can you get out of our way? No way. No strangers can go through here. Never? Never. That big man is blocking our way. I'm going to take care of that. <laughs> Just bounces off his belly. Ouch. I, I didn't do anything. You bumped into me by yourself. You can't even enter the castle by doing that. Hey, big belly. Why can't you just let us in? Hey, Al, you're a king. Can you do something about it? Shh, that's a secret. Oh, come on, Dart, do something. There is no way you can let us in. There are lots of bandits walking around. I was told to never let anybody in. Can we at least send a message to the king? You are pretty. What, what did you say? Oops, I am on duty. I cannot let you in. I cannot let any strangers in. And the dude like randomly just popped a boner. Dude totally popped a boner. What are we gonna do? Should we break through? We are not criminals. We are breaking through. I'm gonna whack that belly. <laughs> Stop it. I was kidding. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> What are you doing? Ouch! I told you so. Don't treat them rough, just kick them out of town. It's no good. We have to think of some other way. I'm sure someone can help us out here in town, right? Hey! Don't you want to talk about something else, like stars? How many times do I have to say it? I want to hear about star dust, not just stars. I told you that if I don't know about it, nobody knows about it. So don't you want to talk about something else? Oh, it's you. Hi guys. You know him? Yes, I do. You're back again, but my boss is not in yet. You know what? I have a good idea. Here, she wants to talk about Stardust. Thanks. What was all that about? 
You must be the folks who bumped into me in Bale, aren't you? I think she's got like a baby on her. Sorry about that. She's just like traveling everywhere with that baby on her back. It's okay. By the way, what were you talking about? Stardust. Hmm. You look like you've traveled all over the world. I might as well just ask you about it. Stardust is a miracle stone, and if you collect them all, your wish comes true. And I have a favor to ask. Why don't you give me the stardust if you find some? Of course, I didn't say free. I'll give you something rare that I found on my journey in return. What do you think? Not bad, huh? You don't have to, but if you happen to find some on your journey, remember me, will you? I decided to stay in this town for a while. It's hard to find Stardust, isn't it? I guess I knew it, though. How about you? Oh, you know, I'm just finding it literally everywhere. I just gave her 27. Thanks! Thanks a million! You literally gave me like half of what I needed. In return, take this. It's the rare thing I promised you. Physical ring, an amulet. Thanks in advance for the next time. I don't think I have any more. Nope. Physical ring and amulet. I think those are both really good. Raises maximum HP. That's pretty good. Doubles maximum MP, that's... Eh. I mean, it's kind of good for Dart. If I'm being serious. Mm. Perhaps I'll give... Miru the physical ring. No, I would think I'd rather give it to Rose. Like, what's better? being able to take slightly less damage or raising your maximum HP by 50%. That is insane. I mean, not on her. It's probably not the greatest, but you know, it's something that pushes her up to almost 800. Yeah, that, I don't know about that amulet. I'm not, I'm not on board with it. Oh yeah. And because of the little cut I had to do, I actually made it through the that that little desert again, like really fast, and so I didn't get to switch to Crush Dance this time. So I gotta use that one more time. But uh oh my god. God, quit please please quit hating me. Hey you're back, what would you like? What? Valley of Corrupted Gravity? We don't have such a cocktail. Why are you thinking that? You want to go there? I don't know what you have in mind, but just chug a lug yep, and forget about it. Hey, Kathy, we are not that kind of bar. Sorry, I got balled out again, but if you really want to go there, you have to ask the king. Are right, you from Sergio? Have you seen the Queen Fury? It's so amazing that you're going to pee in your pants. Awesome. How can I enter the castle? Even with this hip, Kathy, it's still a mystery. She works hard, but she talks to me. <laughs> There's gotta be someone somewhere. One of these has got to be the right place. This fella, this fella's got to help. What? You want to go to the Valley of Corrupted Gravity? I recommend you change your mind. Lately, they say the barons are infested by bandits called the Garages. Of course, when the earth is filled with green, I think those gangs will change their attitude. Mother! Oh. Of course, the guy is like, Oh, I love green. Green, green, green. I only care about the green. It's like it has no like solution for me. 
Give me more green. I, I'll never understand why I always get lost at this point, but I always forget where I need to go. It's definitely a chronic problem I have. Especially in RPGs. Like, I feel like you have to have some kind of guide open when you're playing an RPG. Something, anything, you know? Oh, this case okay, this thing again. Let's see if the lady in the next room over can help. Hey, pregnant lady, can you help? Nope, you're still, still pretty upset about that, huh? Okay, never mind. I'm sure the dead guy on the on the bed doesn't have anything to say. Cause he's dead or dying. No matter how many times you come, the answer is the same. Nobody's allowed to go in the castle except those with. Well, shit. Let's try heading out of town. No, and that didn't work either. Hmm, looks like I'm gonna have to look it up. Well, in the meantime, this episode might be a bit on the short side, but I'd say after the technical issues I've had for the day, it's probably going to have to just remain that way. Um, I'll look it up while I'm out and about, while I'm at work or whatever. And uh, I'll, I'll give the guide I use a little, a little shout out when I come back to the episode. Uh, you know, I've played this game quite a few times, but it's usually after a series of years. And I always feel like this certain particular part is kind of confusing on purpose. Uh, and I always forget. I don't want, don't ask me, but it is what it is. Uh, but thank you so much for watching. And uh, I suppose we'll, we'll see you in the next episode of The Legend of Dragoon. See you later, folks.